Yes, you can milk a scorpion. That's not milk, though, but venom. Scorpion venom is one of the most valuable liquids in the world, highly prized by scientists researching cancer and other diseases. It's given rise to a boom in scorpion farming in many countries in Africa and Asia, but especially in Iran. Our observer Ali Reza Shardari is a wildlife expert and one of the first activists to expose what he says is a big scam. I've been receiving strange messages for about two years. People asking me about how to raise scorpions and sell their venom for mind-blowing prices. It was weird. I'd never heard of it, and I didn't know it was happening in Iran. با اینکه تولید زهر اغرب از شغل‌های پردرآمده ولی انجام این کار نیازمند داشتن مهارت و کسب مجوز از نهادهای زیرربط I ended up getting more and more messages so I decided to investigate to understand what all the fuss was about Ali Reza went online and found hundreds of photos and videos explaining how to raise scorpions and even a scorpion farming app He also found a network of promoters promising to set people up then help them sell the venom the scam starts with con men telling you that if you want a scorpion farm, you have to first buy their scorpions. They tell you to sign up for a training class. Then you need to buy the appropriate equipment. Another way for them to make money. The promoters sell them scorpions as well as insects to feed them, and equipment to house them and breed them. Even UV lights to track their movements in case one escapes. The venom must be milked using specific tools and specific conservation methods. To extract the precious venom, breeders administer an electric shock, making the scorpions eject a small amount from their stinger. We contacted one of the training programs, the Iran Scorpion School, posing as potential clients. They told us we'd have to pay 600,000 toman, or about 45 euros, for a two-day class, then 500 euros for our first batch of 1,000 scorpions. The school promises to buy its clients venom for 60 to 90 million toman per gram, saying they resell it on the international market. When we called back and told them we're journalists, they admitted they hadn't actually bought any venom from their producers yet because the quality isn't good enough. The school told us they work with international venom producers like France's La Toxan and the UK's Venom Tech. Those companies do sell pharmaceutical grade venom for astronomical prices, 15,000 euros a gram. Latoxan told us they had nothing to do with the school or any other Iranian producers. They try to sell us scorpions venom, and our answer is always no. It's hard to believe that any amateur would be able to make a standard product of the high quality needed by companies and researchers. And Venomtech explained that they sell only a total of one gram of scorpion venom a year. We get messages from people from many countries, especially from Iran, when they claim they have 500 grams of venom to sell. This shows they really have no clue about the market for venom. When it's to be used for medical purposes, scientists buy from professional labs, not from amateurs. People should ask themselves, if you can make millions by selling scorpion venom on the open market, then why are these guys selling scorpions to me for 5,000 tommen instead of making the big bucks themselves? Iranian media estimate that about 50,000 people have signed up for scorpion farming courses in the last two years. One farmer told us he had invested a year's salary in setting up, and then a year of his life, to produce two grams of precious venom that nobody wants.